Hey guys, in this video I will show you how to install and set up the Visual Studio Code in Windows and how to run the C or C++ programs in the Visual Studio Code with simple steps. So please keep watching this video at till the end for better understanding. Hello friends, my name is Ganesh Ugle and welcome to my YouTube channel Technical Windows. So in this video I will show you how to install and set up the Visual Studio Code for the C or C++ programs. So first of all we connect our laptop to Wi-Fi and see here these two softwares are need to install in our computer for to run the C or C++ programs. So Visual Studio Code it is a code editor and MinGW it is a software that contains the many libraries and packages that it helps to run the C or C++ code. So it is very mandatory to download and install for run the code. So guys don't worry I will show you how to download it and install it in your computer. So friends go to Chrome browser and search on Google VS Code download and just click on first link download Visual Studio Code for Mac, Linux and Windows and in this link see here the first option was for Windows so click on it and just download it ok so down download has started so after completing the download so we can go to download section and search here the Visual Studio Code download ok so see here the Visual Studio Code so let's install it just accept it agreements and click on next and check this first box okay and click on next and install so it is very simple to install and just wait until the complete the installation successful so after done the complete successful installation so click on finish okay so our visual studio code is successfully installed so guys the next software is mingw okay so this mingw software i will already save in the link and give this link and the description box so please go to description box in this video and click on this link for mingw software okay so i will directly copy this link and search on google and see here after down, after click on this link so one folder was shown that is software okay so just download this software folder so please wait until the download is complete successful okay so after done the download so just come to the download section in windows and in this download section the software zip file is ready okay so just right click on this software file okay and see here the one option is located extract here if you didn't see the extract here option you can see the one option is extract to all and in any case the extract to all option is also not also not visible so please directly open this folder or directly open this uh, downloaded software file and install the mingw software okay and if in your case the extract here is option is visible so please click on this and just wait and open this newly created software folder and also again extract this also so extract here and the our software mingw is ready okay so let's install this software so just di directly double click on it for install and see carefully here the path is located so please change this path so for changing the path click on these three dots and select the this PC location and in the this PC location scroll down and select the local disk C drive only local disk C drive means in your case you can see the one uh, C letter is located in any drive search this uh, letter so please select this local disk C only and click on OK so after click on ok you can see here that this extract to the path is come okay so in your case same path is come okay so just click on extract option and just wait until the extraction complete successful it is very simple to install and extract if any error or any problem occurs in your case so please contact me i will give you my all contact information in the description box so after done the extraction okay so come to this pc and come again in the local disk c drive okay so in the local disk c drive our minji w folder is newly created here okay so just open it and again open the bin folder and in the bin folder just in top section copy this path okay copy this folder path carefully and close it okay and just come to start button and search here the edit environmental variables 
as see here the two options was there edit the system environmental variable and edit environmental variable for your account so in this case you can only select the first option edit the system environmental variable and click on environmental variable and in the system variable section you can see here the path option was there so select it and click on edit after edit click on new option and paste this copied path so after paste directly click on ok and click on all windows ok so after done our wingw software is also installed and configured successfully ok so you can directly open the visual studio code now so guys after opening the visual studio code we need to install two or three extensions for running the c or c++ programs so okay so for this go to extension options and search here the one extension that is name was c or c++ okay and see here the first ex extension click on this and install it in my case i i will already install it in my computer okay so please install it and after this extension install uh, select this second extensions c or c++ extension pack so this extension is also already i will install so please install it and the third last extension is what search here code space runner this code runner okay this is already installed in my computer so please you can install it after done go to file option and select here the open folder okay select this open folder option only and select any location that you want to save the our programs so i want to save these programs all in my desktop so in the desktop section i will create a new folder and give it that name as c++ and select this folder and click on select folder so you can see here the guides the c++ folder is come okay so <clears throat> after done click on this new file option and give the name of your program file i will give here the hello.c first of all i will show you how to run the c program and then next i will show you how to run the c++ program so just go to chrome and just copy the any one program of c just copy it and paste it here so done after done please go to again file and save it carefully and click on these three dots and in the terminal section click on new terminal type here one command that is gcc okay gcc is a compiler it comes with a uh, mingw okay so gcc space for program name that is program name is hello.c and press enter after pressing enter you can see here the our program was successfully compiled okay this command is for compiling our program and then for running a program type one command dot forward slash a dot exe and press enter so see here after pressing enter you can see here the output was come hello world so our program is compiled and run successfully so our c program is done successfully you can directly run this program one click so just see here the one option was runner or debugger in this option click on run code so after click on this you can see here the program is already run okay so guys let's see the how to run the c++ program so just open the our chrome browser and copy the any one program of c++ and paste it on new file that create at was name first dot cpp see here the c is the extension for c language and dot cpp is the extension for c++ language okay so please give this extension carefully for recommended program okay so i will paste it here first dot cpp file and save it again so guys after saving the program you can directly run this program from one click just go to this uh, code runner option okay and click on run code so you can see here the, our code was run successfully okay hello world was come successfully and the second method of running the program is open a new terminal just click on three dots and in terminal section click on new terminal and type one command that for the c++ program is g++ okay carefully type the g++ for cpp and space our program name dot cpp and press enter and see here our program is compiled successfully and then again type one command dot forward slash a dot exe and press enter okay so our program was running complete you can choose any one method you can directly click on run code or you can run our program using the terminal also so guys if you have any problem to running our programs or uh, completing your setup 
so please contact with me i will give you my all contact information in the description box so just check out here and if you any problem so you can also comment it out okay i will check your comment and reply you as soon as possible so guys if you like this video so please subscribe my youtube channel my youtube channel is newly created so please support to my youtube channel and share it in your friends so till then keep learning bye bye take care